What's up guys? We get zero views here. My name is Troy. Join of course is my buddy Liam. What's up man? Hey, what's up guys? I'm looking forward to this. All right, we are back with some more Pokemon Scarlet. Oh yes, and guess who's here? Guess who's here? Bugs Bunny is here. In his, uh, in his giant Pokemon that uh, he has. Now you said before, before we actually get too deep into what we did before, you mentioned Liam that you you, you had a surprise for me. Oh, I do. Oh, I do. I do. I do. Uh, my friend. I do. Ooh. Oh, I do. I do. I do. <laughs> so, uh, because you kind of missed out on uh, some of the event, uh, like the the Cinderace uh, event, mm -hmm. uh, your boy managed to. Uh, Get his hands on a more than one so Ooh. you will be the proud owner of uh the earlier generation fire type which oh ooh. you know i love my fire that's all my fire fiery redhead <laughs> fiery redhead hey it, it, was a, it will be a great companion to have even if you run around having a little uh fire score bunny you know give it to me give it right. to me all right, wants to trade, okay. Begin searching, I guess. Yeah, yes. Hey, there we go. Okay, it said the partner has been found. Same here. Pick, pick a random Pokemon. Uh, anything you want, my friend. All right, I'll give you, I'll give you my, I'll give you my king. My carp king. <laughs> <laughs> the king of the carps. Oh, score, buddy! Please stand by. Oh, here it is! <laughs> Goodbye, Carp King. You serve your prince well. <laughs> Toodaloo! Score, bunny. You serve him well, my friend. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Why is it like Japanese? Uh, Char characters. Uh, don't worry about it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, there's another thing in there that uh, I'm waiting on your decision. If you want to throw any old thing there, there's oh, another, another one. Thing. Okay. I got another thing for you. All right, uh, I'll give you Pennywise. A hey, the dancing clown. <laughs> 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 that's, actually, that's actually pretty good. That's actually pretty good. <laughs> oh my god, really? What? Mm hmm. What? My boy. My Charmander boy. Oh, yes. Come on, communicate. There we go. It's not like you're in UK or anything like that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, bye, Pennywise. You will be missed. <laughs> Boom. Bugs Bunny has sent another Japanese character. <laughs> 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 but yeah, but thank you so much, man. So with that being said, we're going to... Is there more or is that it? I'm just running a quick look through. So uh, yeah, it was just the uh, fire type. So I was able to kind of get a uh, no worries, man. couple no worries. of surplus, which yeah, man. I appreciate it, man. All right, so let's exit this. Uh, so it seems that the trade system is very, very helpful in this game. As long as you're in party with the same person in the union and you go to a link trade, all you really need to do is just hit the uh, link trade and then your other friend hit the link trade and you'll automatically find each other without getting someone outside from the link circle itself. So you don't really, I think, need to do a, uh, uh, a link trade, a link code for protection purposes. All right, I definitely need to level him up because he's, he's he's level one. There's my boy Charmander. What? What? <laughs> Battle! Battle! Kill him! Is War not already? Yeah, he's only a level one, and these will be about level seven, buddy. <laughs> oh yeah, he's he's gonna die. No, don't die. <laughs> he ran to me too. No. Okay. 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 Uh, okay. How do I how do I bring him back? Okay, anyway, we haven't really started the game. Okay, let's, anyway, let us actually start the game. Um, Liam, where did we leave off in the previous episode? 
So we were just getting down and uh, getting the feel for the game. We've uh, we've gone and done through our little exploration of the uh, the main big city in the game. We've met some characters that have definitely left an impression. So much as uh, getting an understanding of the uh, the characters that are. Uh, the newer version of the Team Rocket, basically. And with uh, certain things that come together, it really is kind of uh, an amazing game so far. Um, I'm loving it myself. I hope you're loving it as well, buddy, especially with the uh, inspirational ways of the art design, because this is probably one of the few oh, true open, uh, open world uh, Pokemon games. And that includes Aquius. <laughs> Why, yes, Why is he sleeping? Why is he sleeping? What's his energy like? Uh, like yeah, a... yeah, yeah, yes, full HP. Okay, um, maybe he's just. I, I believe some of them do have animations uh, for when they're uh, relaxing because we can have uh, picnics out, but uh, the only caveat to the picnics is uh, only the host can have all their Pokemon out. Uh, the person coming in uh, will only be able to bring out one of them, which I think is a bit of a. A bit bad, but given the fact that uh, the frame rates kind of dip beyond a certain animation, it's semi understandable. How the freak do I get out of crouch mode? B. Oh, I, I, I was pressing B earlier. Anyway, um, <laughs> so uh, let's see here. Let's check out our map real quick. We basically had a couple of choices. We either going with uh, basically bat battling the gym leaders, the other one was collecting uh, some some materials with uh, uh, Arvin and then the other one was like more of like a hacker character I've uh, I've taken down one tight it's so it's it, it you don't have to do the same set path you don't have to just oh yeah I'll do the gym leaders then I'll do the um, the Titans and then team star um, yeah. it's it's a case of you can take it as your leisure it's uh, they do mention it's uh, one of the very few games where you can pick where you want to go uh, or how you want to start for your play style so like um, I guess we'll just choose the, the pathway uh, I do see a couple of icons here like that like victory road is probably one of the gym leaders and stuff like that um, there's a couple icons that I'm not really too familiar with like this one that's like an ice one one looks like a leaf flying one. Yeah. That's rad! Yeehaw! Now, one thing in terms of when you're exploring with the new system that they've kind of implemented into the game, uh, you've mm. uh, yeah. is the fact that the uh, crafting items feel a bit more like uh, Monster Hunter style. Like you get uh, animal parts per. Um, interaction so whenever you uh, make an animal faint you will uh, get some animal parts or like a pelt or something like that that you then use to make uh, TMs over in the uh, Pokemon. Uh, we, we need to get past this mountain. Okay so... Uh, oh wait, I just, I just touched Pokemon. Oh, oh, oh yeah it's a... Uh, oh a Whopper! I haven't caught you yet. Yeah it's um, a uh, it's a Dark Wampa. Like normally, Ooh, I can, blue. I can terrestrialize. Nice. Let's see what let's see what you do here. Scratch, apparently. <laughs> I probably have to retreat him, but uh, yeah. Oh, I can see him terrestrialize. That's awesome. Oh yeah! Look at you. My god, you um, have like a, an entire chandelier! Oh my god, I died. Oh! <laughs> oh, because he's a, he's a water type, of course. Of course. <laughs> if this was a Nuzlocke, he'll be gone. Like, I just got him and he's gone. <laughs> uh, thankfully, we're not being that cruel to ourselves on our first ever playthrough, guys. <laughs> Alright, that's fine. Yeah, it would right, definitely be a good ride. idea to uh, move uh, uh, more choice Pokemon up until... Uh, yeah, he's still mine. Yeah, he still has experience points anyway. Exactly. Just... So you're looking so to go north past, uh, up past uh, our original house, basically. I mean, what is classified as the first gym? Uh, I think it's the nearest one. The one right here? She's uh, the nearest. She's in a small. Is, she's, she's a bug gym. She's a bug gym? Yeah. That's Tulip. So down to the right. 
The super, the sugar bug. That's the okay. one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Let's set us destination for that. That uh, question remains is how to get there. So we have to go back to the school and actually leave. Okay. So let's leave go back to, to the school. Leave, yeah. leave, leave to the side of the school, you mean? Yeah, leave to, leave to the left side of the school. Okay. All right. Okay. So okay. let's go back to the school. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Are you still behind me? Uh, let's see. Yeah. Oh, there you are. I there am you. indeed. All right. Uh, I'm actually looking forward to when uh, you find uh, a certain city. It's 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 gonna hit you with nostalgia, as uh... like it did for you. Oh man! Like if I could make this one this one small town uh, in this game, like uh, my hometown, like for my character, I would mm -hmm. because it, it hits me in the nostalgia feels in in every good way, <laughs> in every good way. Are we actually heading to towards that direction? Mm-hmm. Okay. Oh, it's N Nimona, of course! Of course! <laughs> hey, it's me, Nimona. It's we should call me! In, it's -a me! We should call and catch each other up on how things are going. I just started! Leave me alone! Mm -hmm. we, we decided to set out heading west from a school, right? How do you know that? <laughs> She's like tracking my phone. <laughs> Life uh, invader. And uh, starting from there, you'd be pretty close to Cortando. That's where you'll find the bug type gym. You can go take the gym leader if you want. I'm sure you can beat her, Sophia. Good luck. I'll catch you soon. Smell you later. Oh my, did she say smell you? Oh my. <laughs> no, she didn't. <laughs> I was gonna say, like, that's a that's an original OG OG triple OG quote right there. No, only Arvin says that. <laughs> there you oh, are. There you is. All right, uh, let us continue. Let's actually do some uh, battling here. Uh, what, what is this? A picnic? Yes, she'll heal your Pokemon. My poor bag's full of tuberculosis ingredients. Let me share some with you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Get strawberry cheese, jam, cream cheese, pepper, mm -hmm. salt. Oh, wow. Now we can make some sandwiches. Oh yes, oh yes. And I know we kind of overlook food, but it's actually more important than I gave it credit for. Oh, initially. Yeah. Your, yeah, your terror orb is all charged. That's cool. So I can terrestrialize now then. Yeah, yeah. So there are certain recipes out there that will help you find more, sh more shiny Pokemon. Grab this real quick and then I'll challenge her for a battle because I want some experience points. I will challenge her as well. We're in this together. <laughs> Alright, you were challenged by Noah the Student. Yep, same name as well. So, uh, we may not have mentioned this uh, in a previous episode, but because uh, me and, me and uh, Talos have actually... Uh, got the different variants of the game we enjoy the effect of having the perk of uh, seeing both versions of the game's exclusive Pokemon while we're in the party and the great thing is we only need to do it once like, exactly so it's, it's a great thing for other consumers out there because it makes things so much more easier that's a good, that's a good point and I'm, my, my Charmander is already level 4 just from that one battle. <laughs> yeah, the uh, EXP share system is a lot more friendlier nowadays, especially when it comes to raising up multiple mo monsters at once, which is, mm -hmm. honestly, it, it saves an amazing amount of time. This poor fellow was no match for my spiffingly good Sinistee. Sinistee? <laughs> Of course you have that one. So so British of you. <laughs> Fainted. Yeah. Wow, level seven Charmander Ray. <laughs> you power leveling, buddy. I know, right? It levels up so quick. Yeah, yeah. Is, and, it, uh, is it true though? Like, by the way, I'm not sure if you know this. Um, is it true that um, traded Pokemon level up faster? I believe originally that was more of a more of a thing, um, but I, I've never seen uh, 
it personally within my uh, within my experience of playing the game so far. But you know, it's it could still be a thing. I've never uh, honestly looked it up to see if it is still a thing. But if it is, then that would be a, an amazing thing because well. Again, sharing is caring. You know, sharing the, uh... is caring, yeah. There's the pokey stuff over there. It's pro that's probably not what it's called, but I'm calling the pokey stuff because it reminds uh, me of the pokey stops from like uh, Pokemon Go. I mean, to be fair with you, they may as well be pokey stops because they kind of incorporate having three different services at once. Always having a Pokemon, pl a place to buy Pokemon Pokeballs. Oh, I'm in the wrong place. site. I'm in the wrong side. I was looking at their... T turn around! You, you know you can talk to them either way, right? Okay, fine. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know about... Do you get like burn heals and ice heals? Or do you feel like that's kind of a, a waste? I mean, to be fair with you, if you're going to go adventuring and you're on a level pegging field, it's certainly nice to have something that will cure confusion sleep uh for sure just purely in the aspect of if it's asleep it can't do much even when it goes into battle eventually if it's confused then i, I believe the confuse effect kind of goes away yeah confuse goes away after you've done with the battle at hand so sleep but i don't think i've used any personally yeah it's one of those things where like it, it, it's nice to have but also like not really needed to have yeah, yeah. Uh, I got low kick there. Ooh, a Mar Mar Mari. Or a Mari. Mary. Mary. <laughs> I'm gonna catch this real quick. Now, if we don't find at least one Eevee, but at least one Eevee during this session, I will give you one Eevee that I have in the storage box. I mean, will, will, it, will it appear in this area? Uh, there's there's a chance for them to appear in a lot of places. Um, uh, with back in the Pokemon Aquius, uh, they had things like Pokemon outbreaks, where there would be a lot of them in one area for you to kind of capture or battle. They kind of implemented the same system over here, onto the uh, over onto this game as well. So you can find uh, when you look at the mini map, you'll notice that there are some Pokemon uh, images in the area. Those are to indicate that there are there's uh, Pokemon in that area. Mary the sheep. Mary the sheep. But spelled like the. Ah. The she. Right, it's, it's it's nice to kick it on some Pokemon for uh, every now and again. It's it's a nostalgia thing, and to see how the game has evolved over the years, it I don't know. It, it makes me smile. It's it's not been a bad experience seeing it evolve over time, whereas some franchises haven't aged as well yeah i'm really loving this game so far though like even though like you probably play a lot more than me who's raining you play you probably play this game a lot more than me but uh for the most part i'm, I'm really enjoying this for, for the little that i played it for yeah i mean having oh look at this look at this look at this they have the truck like from uh gen one if you remember this truck Oh, the missing no truck area. Yeah, the yeah. missing no truck. That is pretty cool. I'm not sure if it's referencing that directly, but um, that's, uh, that's, you, that's, that's how I see it. You know what? I'm calling it canon. I'm calling it <laughs> canon. What is this right here? So those are certain items. So, I, What is a certain item? There's... Oh, no, that's no, a... No, it's a Pokemon. That, that's, a, that's, a, that's a terrestrial eyes or a possible shiny. Oh, uh, as a terrestrialized diglet. Nice. My god, it looks looks handsome. Oh yes, yes. So, so wild terror Pokemon. You cannot catch a Pokemon while it's terrestrialized. Yeah, you you've got to. Yeah. Okay. yeah, yeah. All right. Um, wow, seventeen. My god, it's strong. Not very effective. Not very effective. Not very effective. Fantastic. Oh, oh shoot! Oh, bulldoze. Damn. Okay, we're gonna have to run away. Yeah, we're gonna have to run away. <laughs> he is way too strong for me. He's oh, I can't not run. playing. I can't run away. Prevents. 
Oh no. Arena trap. Oh no. All right, switch Pokemon. All right, uh, shoot. I have nothing that's really effective again. Okay, well, Ariel, go out. You can do it. You can do it. We believe in you, my friend. Cannot be switched out. Oh, what? Oh, man. Because I'm paralyzed, maybe? That's probably what it is. Yeah, I'm dead. Well, they, 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 they really jumped up the levels there. Oh, uh, well, we we have kind of gone into almost the, the next zone. Because uh, the, the school area is kind of the uh, easy as you win. And once you've got kind of your favorite Pokemon that's got a bit of uh, leverage and levels behind them, it's kind of then you kind of start using them as the spearhead so that the others can be uh, lifted up a little bit more. Oh my god, that's powerful. All right, can we run now? No, arena trap. <laughs> oh no, it's, oh my gosh. It looks like it's weak enough. Uh, come on, let's do one more attack. Can I do one more attack? <laughs> I'm trying yes, to help. Astonish does nothing for me. Thank you. <sighs> Super effective. Yes. yes! Yes! All right, now we can capture it. Come on! Let's you get out of here! It. You can do it! You've got this. Ariel! Ariel MVP right there. MVP. <laughs> yes! Uh, your My first God. wild terrestrialized Pokemon. That was intense. Uh, do you want to give a nickname? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. I'm going to call you Terra Dig or Dig Terra. Dig Terra? Dig Terra Dig? Yeah. Heretic. <laughs> yeah. Just so I know it's a Terra version. Because I do have another Diglet that's not a Terra version. Terra Dig It. <laughs> Terra Dig It. <laughs> Can you dig it though? <laughs> All right. Wow. Okay, let's go to the Pokey stuff real quick. I think that's the next town over there. It, it is. It certainly is. And that's a Pokemon that I accidentally ran. I nearly. Uh, I got too close. No. Run away. Run away! Run away! <laughs> it's just tactical retreating. It's not running away. Alright, heal me! Heal me! There will be some nice things to find behind objects and stuff in these different cities that we do end up ex that we'll end up exploring uh, throughout the play through. So there's a little small town here. I don't, but the gym is actually here as well. This big ass building right here. So we'll probably check we'll probably check that out more so in the next episode. Um, see if I see if I can even like defeat this first boss or first uh. Gym leader. Uh, like, how difficult was the gym? Like, what levels were uh, we talking about with the gym leader? Uh, I would definitely say you would need to level up some of your fire types, given the fact that the type advantage that you play against it will help you not need as many levels, but I would definitely advise leveling. Uh, just trying to think what level range it was, because I, I blitzed it. Oh, you, you say you missed it? Uh, I, I was able. To, I was. I was. Uh, I was able to do the challenge. Uh, it was a. It was a piece of pie. But like, what level are you though? Uh, I had it at about twenty-five, I think. Wow. Yeah, you're like way ahead of me. I'm. I'm. My my highest uh, level it, is like twelve. No, <laughs> sorry. It was like twenty-ish. No, it, it was just. It was about the twenty mark, if not maybe nineteen. Because uh, in this one, thankfully, they have put the need for you to have badges. So, you know, you can't have a Pokemon go beyond a certain point before you have uh, one badge under your belt or two badges under your belt because it's uh, 
kind of locked into whether or not they'll ob obey your command. And keep in mind, though, uh, as a caveat to that, that only applies to the main game itself. So if yeah. you had a level 100 and we're only this far in the game, if you go to the terror raids, it mm. will obey you. Hmm. Interesting. <laughs> yeah. Well, this way you can actually go inside the restaurant. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, yeah. Unfortunately, not all of um, not not all of the shops are just uh, you know out skins with uh, a, a transition to a screen. Like okay, there are some nice things. None of them improve fire though. Um, uh, some of them can improve the chances of uh, encountering certain Pokemon. Yeah, I saw that. But it's not what I'm looking for. And there's Liam right there, chillaxing. Mm -hmm. Now keep in mind, like Liam is like way ahead where he's supposed to be. Like he 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 is, he is not supposed to pass me in my playthrough, but I guess he kind of forgot that I got too excited with the game. <laughs> I I, I kind of lost a bit of track of time, and I did stop to a point where I just started trading. There's actually a lot of like these uh these like gym th uh, ba battle things though. Like, can you actually take people here to like battle? I'm like, on my way up. Let's see if uh, let's see if that is a thing. If it is, then that'd be pretty damn cool, to be honest. Uh, stand over here. Yes. I don't think so. I mean, okay. I, I saw like I saw one downstairs, and then, and I saw this one up here. Like, I don't really get the point of. I mean, it, so, it kind of so, makes the world more immersive and all that good stuff. Uh, but yeah, this area here will make a lot more sense to you uh, once you uh, step in towards uh, the final. Uh, yeah, yeah, it's. Yeah, so this it's, is the gym. This is the gym. We're, we're going to be doing this in more so the next episode. All right. So this seems like a pretty good stopping point right, right here, guys. Um, obviously, the gym is right there. So we'll definitely be checking that out. Hopefully tomorrow. We'll probably get destroyed, like according to what Liam is saying, but we're still gonna try it out and um, maybe see what, if I can level up and all that good stuff beforehand. Maybe, we'll see. But uh, that's pretty much all I got. I've been Troy, he's been Liam, and we'll definitely see you next time. Peace. Peace.